Welcome our guests from Warab State and the other counties. Yes, open the way for those who are coming by. Please open the way. Now you do You go back Let clap all of us clap for our excellencies. We pray that this studio and those serving here may be a expression of God's blessing in our society. Father in heaven, we thank you for this broadcasting center which we are opening today. Grant that all the activities that take place here will build up a spirit of community among us. The goal of the radio station is to uh, inform all of the people that can listen to it about issues that are vitally important to them, about issues of health, of education, um, issues of civic engagement, voting, uh, all of these kinds of things. This is a community radio station, and what community radio means is that the station does not belong to any one of us here. So the radio station belongs to everyone in, the, in these areas regardless of their tribe or their political party or their religion or any other way that we talk about ourselves. It belongs to all of us together. Communication are very, very rare because no television, no new FIFA, and no everything. And this radio now is a, a new radio and also we can broadcasting and through our language. <laughs> It's a crucial, important, and historic time, really, in, 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 in all of Sudan and in South Sudan. It's the first elections in 24 years. So now, more than ever, people really need civic education, and I think the radio station plays a really huge role in getting that information out to people. When uh, the election will take place, it will need people also to get some uh, new words or some words from outside from those people who are in far places because by that time everybody will be out uh, voting and where the, when, when there will be some questions or some difficulties that can face them outside also can be simply reported to the radio station It's about uh, 45 minutes past 7 o'clock and you're listening to Mayari FM 90.7. Your radio of hope for those who are sleeping. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Ah, there's been a lot of preparation. It's, it's been a lot of planning. Obviously, there was a contract process where we identified who was going to build the mast and build out the, the inside of the studios. Um, we were working with our partner, Mercy Corps, to develop the floor plan for the radio station um, and the electrical plan. It's a brand new compound here in Tourelle, uh, so fencing off the land. And once the building construction started, then we brought in the mast crew to erect the 60-meter mast that we've got here. And once the building was completed, um, it took us about two weeks to build out to the inside of the studio to soundproof it, um, get the transmitter installed, all that kind of stuff. So it's been, it's been quite a process. Me, I'm so happy to do my and dad and women issue because of what we here in Dinga culture. The women, they don't have a right voice. But so I like so that I can educate women to bring them and I can empower our community so that they know the right of the girl and they know how the best should be a girl to be educated. Mm. There are some people say that whenever you educate a woman, it means that you educate a nation. So we can really to bring up our people. <laughs> Today I'm so happy. Children are singing. Old girls are dancing outside. Women, people are running, moving up. It's really very great joy in my editor from today because they have known really they will be having the right and they will be having the boys. Because since we have radio, everything will be easy. We will solve any problem between communities. They will, we will bring them up right now. They will grow now as a people who are a man. Okay, they will think proper. They will not involve anything easy. So, it's really very great job today. Me, especially I really. I'm really about even to die and to move up, jump from whatever. Okay, I'm really very glad because I've seen some joy up today. And I have hope that we will continue doing our programs.